Hey Glim Squad, what's up? This is your girl Dalu. Today I am going to show you how I'm painting my front door. I feel like this door does not represent the interior portion of my house. The white is fading away and very dated. Painting this door was a long time coming. I am so happy finally I get to do it. I'm gonna start by showing you how I prep the door and showing you some of the materials that I purchased to paint the door. Everything that I'm going to show you, I purchased them from Home Depot. This is a set of brush that I purchased. It has a medium one, a small one, and a large one. A liquid sandpaper to help the glass and clean the door. I bought this plastic paper to cover the floor, but I'm not going to be using them since I'm going to do some work on the floor as well. I also bought this electric sander to sand the door in the bigger surface area. I also got a friend to help me out. I call him Amigo. This is me asking him if he wanted to do it and telling him he was going to be on camera. And he was like, okay, sure. <laughs> my Amigo doesn't really know how to do the job. Basically, I had to do my own research and learn how to paint the door to get the project done. But he is very useful and helped with a lot of the heavy lifting and anything else I don't feel like doing. While, while he's doing the sanding, I'm going to start with the liquid sandpaper to do the little area where the sander could not get to. Keep in mind, before you start the sanding process, you got to give the door a good clean to remove all the dirt and all the dust that has been on the door did that yesterday to make sure that the door is dried completely next we're gonna be putting painter tip around the glass This is the paint that I'm going to use. It is the Bear Marquee from Home Depot in the color black. It is a semi-gloss finish for exterior painting. Although I wanted to use a matte or flat finish, but most of the experts say semi-gloss is best for exterior door because it is more durable. That's the reason I'm going to use that instead. I'm going to start in the oval portion in the corner because when I did the research, that's where they said I have to start. I'm using the smaller angle brush that came in the pack. If you are new to my channel, welcome to the Glam Squad family. Once again, my name is Talu. I upload Glam Home Decor and DIY videos. Make sure you hit your subscribe button and turn on your notification bell if you are into these things so you don't miss anything as soon as I upload. Big thank you to all of you, my Glam Squad. Yeah, I know I love you. Make sure you check me out on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok at Glam Style with Dalu. Turn you on. 
then I'm gonna be painting the other corner in the square while my friend is using the medium sized brush to do the other corner on the right. As you can see, all the corner in the middle portion are done. Using a large size brush, I'm going to be finishing the rest of the middle portion while my friend is doing the corner at the bottom. I have to be honest, I was very anxious about starting this project because I talked about all the time how I don't know how to paint in this channel, but here I am painting the very first thing that's a hello to someone when they come to my house but I realized you know what the door is already bad it cannot get worse so I'm gonna give it a try and if it doesn't go well then I would have to get a professional to help me out or I would just have to redo it let me be honest I don't know a single thing that I haven't done to make you notice me let me when I see you, my heart starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands start shaking all of the time when you're around me. But this time, this time, girl, I know what's bothering me. I need somebody to love. Oh, na 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 na. Don't you see? Guys, my goal is to get the channel to 50,000 subscribers by the end of December. Please help me reach my goal by sharing this video or any other videos with your friends and a family member or in your social media pages. I will be forever grateful to you. It's a shame that my hands start shaking all of the time when you're around me. But this time, this time. Give the door two coats of paint after the first one we let it sit for two to four hours now i am doing the second one today was a perfect day to paint the door it wasn't too cold neither too hot it was low 60 high 70 so perfect weather Did you ever stop and think why spend too much time just getting ready? Let me be honest, I don't know a single thing that I haven't done to make you notice me. I am almost done with the paint job. I'm going to remove the tape before the paint gets dry completely. This is very important. This is the next day, the paint is totally dry but I'm gonna do a little bit of touch up in the area where the tip was.
in this area i have to be very careful because i do not want to pet the nap but one thing that i have learned is to keep my eyes before the bush and the bush will follow my eyes when i see you my heart starts racing but i don't know if i like this chasing and playing and waiting around down here i'm just fixing the paint a little bit because i didn't like the bush stroke so i'm just fixing it to make sure it goes in the right direction Okay, my friends, I am done. Let's see the transformation. But before we do that, let's look at the before. And now the after. I love, love, love my new door. I love the transformation. Last time I asked somebody to give me an estimate to paint the door, they asked for $350 plus the cost of paint. I am so happy I did it myself. Now I learned how to paint the door. I got so excited, you guys. I painted my shutter. Stay tuned, a video will be up for that. Guys, show me you appreciate my effort by giving me a thumbs up and share it in your social media pages with your friends and your family this is how the channel is gonna grow please support me this way and if you have not subscribed come on what are you waiting for hit that subscribe button and turn on your notification bell so you can get notified once i upload a new video i thank you so much for stopping by today i will see you on the next one i love you always bye bye